everyone, this is Justin with Forbes, Heber & Wallace. Today is the maiden voyage of our Behind the line segment where we aim to provide you some good information as it relates to best practices, maintenance, or operation of your equipment or any other tips that might be helpful. And today's Behind the Line is a tip as it relates to the Frankie Super Automatic and Two-Step Espresso machines when it comes to installation and calibration. I just left the demo at a school district where we were setting up the Frankie machine and the issue came up as far as what beans do we use and what often happens during the installation and calibration of the machine at the beginning of this whole process is that the operator, in this case a school district, might not have the coffee beans that they're going to be using going forward. So what they do is they run down to the local grocery store, they grab a couple bags of Starbucks beans or whatever and then that's what ends up getting used for the installation and calibration of the machine. The problem with that is if the operator is not planning on using those specific Starbucks beans for the operation going forward, the machine is going to be programmed or calibrated based off of those Starbucks beans and they're going to have a different flavor profile than the beans that they might opt for going forward. So what you end up having is the machine getting programmed with super dark roasted beans that have a different weight to them and then the operator will use a medium roast bean with a different weight to it and then the flavor won't come out exactly the way that you want it once you switch beans. So it's very critical that when you are doing the installation and calibration of these machines that you have all of your supplies ready specifically as it relates to the beans, the powder, the milk, and the syrups. So that was today's Behind the Line. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.